The city of Dallas is working on a plan to address the economic racial divide in the community. Steve Pickett in South Oak Cliff with more from those crafting that plan. The houses of Dallas's Redbird neighborhood in Oak Cliff, the shops and stores along Lancaster Road, the schools on the city's south side. Today, they reflect a long standing view. They are undervalued, underserved, and overwhelmed. It's like a cancer. Whether you acknowledge it or not, it, it, it still is having an impact on your, on your body. Sarah Mokuria is an urban study specialist now aligned with the City of Dallas project. Dean Dallas's mostly black and Latino neighborhoods as valuable as others. It is time for us to address this issue. They call it the Dallas Racial Equity Plan. Mayor Pro Tem Casey Thomas says city government is now charged with this agenda. Ensure life for Dallas's mostly minority communities receive the same services, programs, and development as the city's thriving north side. We have instituted policies that have been discriminatory and unfair. And so now it's time for us to say, we've done this as a city, but how do we correct it? Racial equity, Thomas says, is not providing equal attention to Southern Dallas, but providing more attention to business development, housing quality, and jobs for the people who live on the Southern side. And that specific meeting that showcases this plan that happens tonight in about 30 minutes, less than 30 minutes, the Dallas Racial Equity Plan at Friendship West Baptist Church in the southern sector of the city on Wheatland Road. Again, it begins at 6.30 this evening. By the way, the Dallas School District also with a racial equity plan to address the concerns of minority children. The vast majority of the school district is minority, but the attention they say is still needed. Reporting live, Steve Pickett, CBS 11 News.